President Donald Trump promised to drain the corrupt swamp that is Washington, D.C. Over the course of his first two years in office, we've seen exactly that. The swamp hasn't just been drained in D.C. Across Hollywood, the media, and our government, corrupt liberals have been outed for their crimes. Numerous corrupt figures, all of whom supported the Democratic Party, have lost their careers, and more are coming. Recent weeks have revealed more vile swamp dwellers in our midst. Some of the most powerful people in our government, men and women entrusted with our safety, have been exposed as villains. Now Trump has renewed his vow to get rid of these bad people. Their days in power are numbered. From Daily Caller, President Donald Trump said that bad people in the American intelligence community are being exposed for what they are in an interview with Fox News Tucker Carlson airing Tuesday. Trump called out former FBI Director James Comey along with Agent Peter Strzok and FBI Attorney Lisa Page in particular. I also think that when you watch Peter Strzok and Lisa Page, when you watch all of the things that have happened Comey, you take a look at that, and McCabe, who's got some pretty big problems I assume, you look at the deception, the lies. Trump also singled out the intel class in general, saying, these are people that in my opinion are truly, they're bad people, and they're being exposed for what they are. Apostrophe. For all of the hype around the Mueller probe, we are learning more about corrupt insiders. Nothing has come out to expose Trump, because there is nothing. Instead, we see more and more Obama, Hillary allies being revealed as criminals. Top people within our Justice Department are working against our democracy. They continue to allow their bias to corrupt the case of justice. Important cases are undermined so their preferred political candidates will get a pass. We have to stand up and do something. We have to spread the word as good citizens, and make everyone aware. We can't let corrupt criminals run our government. Share with your fellow patriots if you agree.